Hey Mandy, here's a uh, quick demonstration I promised you on how to fix the uh, the problem in the horizon lines when we merge panoramas and we get those little glitches in it. This is the panorama that I uh, merged using the 10 images that Ron posted in the cohort and it has a uh, glitch down here in this area. Let me click on the uh, magnifying tool here and let's go down and take a look at it. Yeah, there it is. Let me arrow over here a little bit so we can put it in the center of the screen. This is the glitch that I want to fix right here. And, uh, you know, I, and I've used some different methods over the years. I, I, I do a lot of panoramas, and I've um, usually used the clone tool, but recently I found the uh, skew tool works pretty well. And the way I use that is I go up here to the uh, rectangular marquee tool, click on that, and I put the uh, crosshairs right on the part of the horizon that is correct and then spin out a rectangular marquee to the left on the incorrect part of the horizon until it matches up as you see the top of that matches the top of that so this is the area that needs to be fixed right here that is skewed that it's uh, um, shifted downward so to fix that I go up to edit come down to transform go over to skew click on skew and that puts the the little handles on the uh, square box that the rectangular marquee tool made I go up here to this uh, box at the top right corner click on that and then lift upwards until I match up the horizon like this. so that sort of fixed the horizon there let me uh, click the uh, check box to accept that uh, and then hit control D to deselect that area and as you see the horizon is nice and straight now in fact if we pull a, uh, a guideline down on there you can see it looks pretty good but of course I created some other uh, problems. Let me clear that guide off of there. There's a, a, a little glitch here, but if I go over it, th this is so much quicker to take the spot healing brush, click on that, and then just let Photoshop fix that uh, glitch that I made there. That fixes that real easy. Then pick up the, um, the clone stamp tool and fix this other little glitch right here by cloning this area into here. And that pretty much fixes it. That, that took care of the problem just quickly. And I, I, I find that to be a real clean method. If I go up here to my history, uh, I can show you the before and after. Click on that, there's before. Click on that, after. Take a look at the uh, area right here again as I uh, click it off. There's the uh, before. And there's after. That's a real quick and easy way to fix that. It works pretty well for me. So I hope that's helpful. I bet somebody else will come in and, and show me a better way to do that. I hope they do. I'd like to find an even better way. But this one, this one makes me pretty happy. See you later, Mandy. Bye-bye.